Hey, hey, we're uh, doing a few little minor repairs on a Toyota Hilux. This bloke's put a uh, Holden motor in it, the V6, with the 700R4, um, also known as the 4L60, with a cable kick down or pressure cable on it. So his complaint is that it's changing through to top gear too quickly. Um, just no power sort of going into top gear up to about 20 or 30 k's so usually it's an easy fix um, I'll just show you on the cable there now it's a 1990 LN106R um, Hilux 1990 model uh, but he's, you can see he's got the, the Holden 3.8 litre V6 in it um, first of all, I'm just going to check the oil level, just make sure that's right. Um, but this cable here actually controls the pressure in the transmission. So um, they have like a little ratchet mechanism, I'll show you in a moment. Now, this is where basically the cable was. I've marked it with a bit of liquid paper. And then if you don't have anyone to press the accelerator for you, um, I've got this little gadget I've got. Um, it's just a bit of flat bit of steel with a hole drilled through it. And I just push that down on the pedal and adjust it and push it off the seat there, if you know what I mean. I've just got to put the camera down to do it. Okay, that's flat down to the floor. And you can see it's just resting there. Um, that's basically the full travel of the accelerator so now we're going to go under the bonnet again and basically you can see that the cable is still a little bit loose so um, these cables have a ratio which is basically the ratio between the outer cable and the inner cable um, so you can adjust it by just pressing this little little clip here and by increasing the pressure you're actually making the inner cable tighter or the distance between the inner and outer cable longer. Um, if you want to back it off, you, you bring them back together. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to put the camera down again, um, press this, and I'm just going to slide it out um, until this cable is just, just fairly tight. And there we go. You can see what I mean. I've actually tightened the cable. There is a little bit of movement there, but you can see how much I've moved it. The, the left hand mark there is where it was, and I've actually moved it back there. So it's just like tightening this inner cable. Now I've just had it for a test run, and it's actually shifting quite normally. There's a little bump when um, you go to stop, so what, what I can do now is just I've got the mark where it was and the mark where it's flat down to the floor and now I'm just going to back it off a tiny bit and give it another run and that's basically how you adjust that um, the throttle the throttle cable um, is inside the transmission there's like a, a, a little valve that it operates on and it'll control your, your shift pattern you know how quickly it changes through the gears and even a little bit on the firmness so he just wants it chaining normally in this so um, ideally I like to have them at maximum pressure the transmissions operating properly um, or as best as it can but some people don't like it shifting like that so you can just back it off a little bit until till that little bump disappears so I hope that makes sense. Anyway, thank you for watching.